Good evening everyone. So tonight we will talk about the specific rules that leads to fitness. So the several internationally accepted scientific exercise training principles should ideally be followed in the study of exercise science to get the most out of exercise programs and increase physical fitness and sports performance. No, so these specific rules no needs to be followed in order na maging tayo is maging fit no and then walang ma mga injuries mga ganon and then these rules are the fundamental exercise science core principles that apply to all athletes no pwede siya sa mga athletes such as mga beginners also and sa mga professionals din, no? or mga elite, mga elite competitors, mga ganyan. So, many people want to get in better shape, improve sports performance, and get better at a particular fitness discipline. No? So, according to exercise science, these fundamental rules are the hidden force behind the ability to change your fitness level. No? So, kanina mga uh, matakal na mo sa mga principles na is matutulungan kayo nito no? in order na ma-improve yung uh, gusto nyo yung i-improve yung body shape nyo and then kung may mga sakit nyo kayo, pwede ninyo itong gamitin no? ng mga principles in exercise no? or fitness. So, we have six specific rules that leads to fitness no there are principles of individual difference principles of overload principles of progression principles of adaptation principles of use or disuse and lastly we have principles of specificity so tonight, we will tackle first about the principles of individual differences. So, we people guys, we all have our different characteristics now, our personalities. So, we are unique within ourselves. So, in terms of exercise guys, we all have uh, different capacity also now. We all respond to different exercise programs now in different ways. So, in principles of individual differences, guys, we will all respond to an exercise program in slightly different ways. Exercise programs that are well designed should take into account our individual differences and responses to exercise. So, just like for example, guys, no, you are a, an obese, no? You are obese and then you have a goal today that uh, mag exercise ka and then five rounds no five rounds na pag jogging and then syempre as an obese no um dali ra jud ka hangakon and then yung mga joints mo is dali ra pud magsakit no dali ra ka ana and then two rounds sa jud imong nakaya no two rounds sa jud imong nakaya sa five rounds na imong gusto and then gusto man jud nimo maset nimo ang goal na na five rounds so imong gipugos imong sarili which is dili jud siya pwede guys right na ay tendency na you will faint no magkakaroon ka ng heart attack also and then yung high blood pressure mo is tataas so um na nun jud different capacity no sa atong lawas individual of us each individual of us no we have all um, the different capacity no within ourselves we are unique so hinahinay na juta in terms of exercising no if payat pud ka guys may uban na nagaimo na dili na pwede mag exercise so which is dili jud siya pwede need jud nato na mag-exercise no. Basta na sa tambok baka or payat baka. 
or sa mga labo kay sakit, ng ana, need ka po na ito mag-exercise. But, um, limit lang. Nasa tayo specific lang na exercises no na um, igo lang para dito sa ato. Some of these differences na have to do with the body shape or body size na as I said earlier, the past experiences, just like for example, um, na injury na ka dati no, sa tayo sa tuhod. So, um, wala pa man kayo naulian, sakit pa man kayo i-jogging. So, pwede ra ka mag-walking, no? Just for mga 30 minutes walking. And then, pwede ra po ka mag-dance, no? And then, the chronic conditions also. Just for example, kung nakay sakit sa heart. So, um, need nyo mag-adjust, no? Just like, for example, ng mga dancing lang, mga 30 minutes, or walking. Na nagapan ay, for example, mga 30 minutes, no? In a day. And then, my injury, as I said earlier, need na to mag-adjust. No, dili na to dapat bigla on jud atong sarili when it comes to exercising. So, ang makakatulong talaga sa atin, guys, no, when it comes to exercising is with the help of our professionals, no, just like, for example, mga doctors, then therapists, no, we need to consult, no, magpa-consult sa ilaha una, so, kanam para mahibal ah ato kung unsa atong sakit no kasi na ana kay heart disease day dira ano and then magpa tuga tuga kag exercise mga vigorous no and then dili kaya sa mo ang lawas or heart kasi na possibility jud na ang um, ka heart attack ka no and then basin high blood pressure ka guys no so need na to magpa consult jud una sa ato mga professionals no and then, mga yung advice sa nila ha, kung unsa lang ang mga specific exercises na pwede lang sa ato ano, na makaya lang dyan sa atong sarili, sa atong lawas. And then, first thing dyan guys is, dili ta, mag una sa mga vigorous exercises na, dito lang dyan ta mag una sa mga moderate exercises. So that's all for the principles of individual differences.